Hello everyone! Here in this video I will teach you how to use conditional blocks in order to create multiple outputs of the same project using output tags. To differentiate and distribute content among different versions of a user manual, output tags should be created. To create an output tag, go to Tools, Global Settings, click Show Advanced Settings. Under Dynamic Output, choose Output Tags. Here you can create an output tag. As an example, I'm willing to create two output tags. One version of my user manual about the magic wand is aimed at unexperienced mages, so it will have only some basics of the magic wand usage. For this version I'm creating an output tag for beginners. Click Create Output Tag, type a name and click here. Ok, now I need one more output tag for the pro version of my user manual. Click Create, write the name and click OK. Great, now I'm going back to my projects. Click Projects, choose the right one from the list, this is my project, click Open. For example, I would like to add conditional blocks to this topic. First, I need to switch to the edit mode. For this, I need to click the lock and edit button. To add conditional blocks, I need to go to the single sourcing tab on the editor's ribbon bar. Here, I need to find the conditional content section. I have already chosen the place where the conditional block will be set. Now I need to go to the conditional content section, click here in this field and choose the beginner output tag first, as I want to create a beginner conditional block. I want to insert including and here it is, the box has appeared. Now I need to delete the default text and to type the text of my own. Now, when I will publish this project with the beginner tag, then this topic will have this content inside this box plus all the content that has no output tags. But I wanted to create another output, the pro version. And for this, I will include the pro output tag right here under the beginner. I'm going back to the conditional content section. I need to delete this. Click here again. Choose Pro and start including. Now I just need to add my text. Now I'll show you how to publish your project with the selected output tag. I'll publish the project with the beginner output tag so that I will have the contents of this box and the rest of the topic. But I will exclude the Pro output tag. So, this section won't be visible in the output. To publish a project, first click the Unlock and View button, go to the View mode, then go to Current Project, Publish, Export. In the Publish Project wizard, choose Show Advanced Options, choose the needed output tag, Beginner. Click Next and wait till it publishes. Click Next one more time. Your publication is finished. Click Finish. Your publication has appeared right under the project. Let's see. Click Open. Let's go to the General One properties. As you see, under Once Chosen New Masters, we have only the part that had the beginner output tag. If we publish the same project but choose the Pro output tag, we will have a publication where the same section will have only the content of the Pro output tag. Creating different outputs of the same project aimed at different audiences is easy in Click Help. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us.